Hey, this is Presh Talwalkar. Weather in Mathland is determined by chance. If it rains on a given day, then the probability it will rain the next day increases by 10 percentage points, up to 100%. If it does not rain on a given day, then the probability it will rain on the next day decreases by 10 percentage points, down to 0%. If the probability it will rain today is 60%, what is the probability that it will eventually rain every day for all time? Can you figure it out? Give this problem a try, and when you're ready, keep watching the video for the solution. We'll set up the problem by writing P sub X to mean the probability it rains forever from a day with an X percent chance of rain. When the probability of rain reaches 100%, it will rain forever, and when the probability of rain reaches 0%, it never rains again. According to our notation, this means P sub 100 is equal to 1, and P sub 0 is equal to zero. We're interested in the intermediate probabilities, which will depend on the probabilities of these other states. For example, if the probability it rains on a given day is 90%, we will either transition with 90% to the probability state where we have a 100% chance of rain, or we will transition with the 10% chance to the probability state of an 80% chance of rain. Similarly, suppose there's an 80% chance that you're going to rain on the given day. There's going to be an 80% chance you're going to increase by 10% to the 90% state, and there's going to be a 20% chance that you're going to decrease to the state of having 70% chance the next day. We can similarly compute these probabilities for all the other states. Each day you're going to transition either up 10% or down 10% depending on the current day's probability of rain. We now have a system of equations and we can solve this systematically. We start from the very last equation. We have p sub 0 is equal to 0, which we then substitute into the next equation. We then get p sub 10 in terms of p sub 20. We'll then use this information and substitute in to the next equation. We can slowly climb up this ladder of equations and get each state in terms of the probability of another state. Now where does this ladder end? Well when we get to the top we have p sub 90 is equal to 511 over 512 times p sub 100. Now we know that p sub 100 is equal to 1, so we know that this is equal to 511 over 512. We now climb back down the ladder of this, these sets of equations. We can substitute in the probability p sub 90 into the previous state p sub 80, and we'll keep climbing down until we get to p sub 60, and this will be 191 over 256 which is approximately a 74.6% chance that it will rain forever. And this is the answer to our problem. Did you figure it out? Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel. I make videos on math and game theory. You can catch me on my blog, Mind Your Decisions, which you can follow on Facebook, Google Plus, and Patreon. You can catch me on social media at Presh Talwalker. And if you like this video, please check out my books. There are links in the video description.